Notre Dame Green Pond, a team that started this season 3-1 and one overall before dropping its last two games to Palmerton and North Schuylkill. The Crusaders hoping to get back in the win column on Friday with their Week 7 matchup with fellow Red Division foe in Northern Lehigh. The Bulldogs coming off a 45-13 win against Salisbury in Week 6. Between a rowdy homecoming student section paired with the introduction and appearance by heavyweight world champ Larry Holmes, Friday night in Easton was an atmosphere like no other. That night also marked the first time the Crusaders were back at home in two weeks. However, the offense still had to wait a bit on the sidelines for their chance to get back to work. Northern Lehigh's ground game taking nearly eight minutes off the clock, but Darno didn't need much time at all to get his team going. On a second pass, he and James Weiscarver connected for 77 yards and the score to give the home team its 7-0 lead with just under three left in the first quarter. A Notre Dame defense that led up 69 points in weeks 5 and 6 responded brilliantly just four plays later. A Nino Morisi pick gave Notre Dame prime field position on the 9-yard line. And once again, just two plays later, the Crusaders extend its lead to 14 with a 5-yard TD run. This time it's from Josh Ludlow on the first play of the second quarter. Ludlow was very busy for the Navy in gold as the senior hauled in already his second score of the night. The hookup between Darno and Ludlow for 39 yards this time. Darno had 17 straight completions on a night where he went 18 of 19 for 375 yards and four scores. Crusaders set comfortable at the break, up 21 to zero. Darno's favorite target, of course, was Ludlow, connecting for four touchdowns as Ludlow racked up 180 yards of total offense, 148 of those receiving. Darno spread the wealth, hooking up with six total receivers, though. He'll find Jason Blacknall Farmer for a 32-yard pitching catch to extend the lead to 28 nothing Crusaders early on in the third. Ludlow added two more in the fourth quarter as Notre Dame hands the Bulldogs a tough loss. The Crusaders cruise to the 42-7 victory, one that Coach Phil Stamball believes will propel them to a strong finish in this final three-game stretch in the regular season. We kind of expected that grind through the middle of our season. Uh, last year we were able to go 3-1. and one. Right now our goal is to finish 2-2. Two and two. Getting this win tonight was huge. Because we, we feel like we've been playing pretty well. We just are, are playing very good competition, and hopefully that competition we get to see again in the playoffs if we take care of the rest of the regular season. Uh, it's great. We needed the confidence going into next week versus a tough game versus Jim Thorpe, and uh, it was just great to get a win. I just think we were dynamic. We played very well on both sides of the ball, and uh, we were able to pass the ball well. We got our pass game on um, track, and uh, that was just great to see. Yeah, it hurt us a lot getting two losses in a row, um, but our message was just, just keep focus, uh, keep battling because we're going to be in the postseason, but it's where we are like that's going to matter. Well, like I said, to, to keep getting up uh, week after week for a title fight as we're kind of calling it, and it was fitting to have Larry Holmes with us tonight. Um, you know, for the kids to, to be able to emotionally and physically keep playing these uh, tough teams, you know, week after week is, is a challenge. And I don't think the score is indicative of, of – how hard it is to stop a team like Northern Lehigh and, and how proud we are of our defense for being able to do that.